Good morning, it's Nicole and today I'm taking you through the first day of quarantine on the North Shore. My test results haven't come back quite yet and I've tried expediting them. So it should be another day or two, hopefully not longer than that, that I'll be quarantined here in this room. So I'll show you a bit of that and what I've been on doing to keep myself busy during the summer quarantine. And just super thankful to be here. I'm doing Ramwad mobility. Just finished my Pilates workout. Now I'm going to go ahead and clean up. I'll include the link to the Pilates two videos that I just did. I just had like lip swelling and tingling from the oranges so I think I was having like I googled it and it said like allergic reaction which is weird because I've never had any problems with citrus in the past but either way I probably shouldn't eat them um, and I am putting ice on it because that's when they google things they say like Benadryl or like an antihistamine so I don't have any of those but ice is supposed to work as well I just got the submission from the lab that did my testing and it's negative it's all clear i just have to wait for the government to give kind of a sign off or go ahead so that i can be all good and got the fins on the surfboard and kind of cleaned and tidied everything up organized stuff and now i'm gonna have a quick snack i'm having a go macro and then i'm going to go through and edit some photos so i have some portraiture from back in north carolina that i'm gonna work on editing so right now i'm going through photos and i'm gonna take you a little bit behind the process so typically where I start is I start going through the raw files before I bring them into like Lightroom or Photoshop but to do that I essentially look through and I decide like which photos I actually want to try and edit. It does take a little bit for them to load but I feel like it's so much better than going through every single photo. I just like get rid of the ones that I don't like and I keep the ones that I like so then I can narrow them further. And then the ones that I determine that I like and I think it would look really good or that they'd be final photos, then I go through and put them into actual Lightroom and Photoshop, like actually import them in there. Also, I'm having a late lunch today. I am currently cooking up some beans and I'm going to pair it with some veggies and some of the mango salsa that I'm excited to try. Still editing. So right now, for the past couple hours, I've been going through photos of my friend Kaylee, and then I went through and deleted some of the photos that I won't be using. Currently, I'm refining the images that I am going to be using, so I'm in both Photoshop and Lightroom for that. So I just finished editing a batch of photos. This is my friend Kaylee, and here's how some of the final images came out. We're playing with the shade here with the longboard over the head. And I like the contrast of that day. It was super harsh lighting, so we worked with it. It was about mid-morning when we did this, and we did the shoot in Wrightsville Beach on a super windy day. Waves were not so good, but it was still so fun. We tried a bunch of different angles with like the waves coming up just to see like which ones we would like. I kind of like this one best, though. 
and then some of the ones before like that one and that one are really cool and I also like these like the way the shade hits the face and stuff I really like this one Oh, I'm stoked with all these Thanks things. so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you want to see more stuff like this.